What is up guys, now that 2016 has arrived, it's time to take a look at all the big exclusive games coming to the PS4. New Network brings you the 9 most anticipated first party exclusives coming this year to the PlayStation 4. Number 9. Dreams Dreams is an upcoming sandbox video game developed by Sony Computer Entertainment for the PlayStation 4. The game puts focuses on play, create and share and allows players to create user-generated content. In Dreams, players control an imp which is used to interact with the game's world. Players move the imp by using the DualShock 4 or the PlayStation Move controllers. The imp is customizable and players can change the motion of the imp by drawing on the controller's touchpad. Players encounter different puzzles in the game, which must be solved by using the abilities of the imp and the possessed characters, as well as the objects players retrieved in a dream. Items collected by players can be used to alter and modify the state of the game's world. Players can create their own levels in the game by using custom and pre-built objects. Players can then share their completed levels online. Cooperative multiplayer is also featured in the game, allowing players to create and manipulate their custom dreams together. Number 8. Drawn to Death Drawn to Death is an upcoming free-to-play third-person shooter multiplayer video game. The game is a four-player arena shooter. It is set inside a teenager sketchbook, so the world and action embody the juvenile tone of the child's illustrations. Players pick a sketch character and drop them into environments drawn upon the book's pages. Each character will have its own behaviors, passive tendencies, buffs and special attacks. The arenas are set to feature multiple secrets to be used as weapons against enemies. Weapons and gameplay mechanics represent the juvenile tone. Regarding the potential of a weapon progression system, the developers say skill should be the only determining factor. If you have been playing this game for a year and I just come in and I'm awesome at these type of games, the only reason you should win is you know the map better and are more comfortable muscle memory wise. It should never be because you have better weapons. The game does not have an exact release date at this point. Number 7. The Tomorrow Children The Tomorrow Children is an open-world sandbox adventure video game developed by Q Games and published by Sony Computer Entertainment. The Tomorrow Children is an online open-world sandbox adventure where you and others must cooperate to build a town and defend it from giant monsters. It takes the collaborative building mechanics from Minecraft and fuses it with cartoonish visuals inspired by a Soviet Union-themed dystopia. The game runs on a proprietary game engine developed by Q Games. The game's graphics engine utilizes new technology, aiming to achieve a pixel-like pre-rendered CGI look with real-time 3D graphics. It utilizes the PlayStation 4's async compute technology extensively. Number 6. Ratchet and Clank Ratchet and Clank blasts onto PlayStation 4 for the first time with a new game based on elements from the original Ratchet and Clank. Ratchet and Clank reimagines characters' origin stories and modernizes the original gameplay, featuring all new boss fights, several new planets, new flight sequences, and much more. With completely new visuals constructed to take advantage of the power of the PS4. Produced alongside the major motion picture coming to theaters in 2016, Ratchet and Clank is a curated experience borrowing from the spirit of the classic PS2 titles while infusing some of the best elements from the Ratchet and Clank future games. Return to the Solona Galaxy and find all your favorite characters, Ratchet, Clank, Captain Quark and super villain Chairman Drek, as well as many new ones in this third-person action-adventure platformer. Explore exotic planets, collect out-of-this-world weapons and help Ratchet and Clank save the galaxy for the first time, again. Number 5. Gravity Rush 2 in addition to Gravity Rush Remastered coming to PS4 in February, Gravity Rush 2 is also coming to North America, exclusively on PS4. In the sequel to the acclaimed PS Vita original, you will have brand new gravity shifting options and combat mechanics at your disposal. Cat can now use three gravity styles that add more variety and combat options, Normal, Lunar and Jupiter. In Lunar style the force of gravity is reduced, making Cat lighter and quicker. In Jupiter style the gravity is increased slowing down Cat's movements but making her more powerful. You can switch between Cat's three gravity styles seamlessly to combine the styles into different combos for each situation. Also new to Gravity Rush 2 is the tech battle system, which pairs you up with an AI-controlled ally to take on the more serious opposition like Raven assisting Cat. 
Number 4. The Last Guardian The much anticipated The Last Guardian is finally hitting PS4 this year. Originally announced as a PS3 exclusive during E3 2009, the game suffered numerous delays over the years due to technical challenges in its development. It was also consistently absent from events and trade shows, leading gamers to question if the project was still in development. However, that all changed when Sony re-announced the game for the PS4 at E3 2015. It's currently being worked on by Sony Computer Entertainment Japan Studio and Gen Design, the studio consisting of staff that work on the critically acclaimed and iconic PS2 games, Ico and Shadow of the Colossus. The Last Guardian has been shown to involve a young boy who befriends a giant bird, dog and cat hybrid creature Trico, and the two work together to evade guards that are after them both. The game requires the player controlling the boy to manipulate Trico like a real animal, such as luring it with food as to use the creature as a means to climb and reach high platforms or other remote places. This sets the core of the game on puzzle-based action, as in between the various puzzles the player will encounter, enemies will be encountered, potentially impending progress. Number 3. Gran Turismo Sport Racing Simulator fans have a new game to look forward to in the upcoming Gran Turismo Sport. The latest entry stands out from its predecessors, featuring two official FIA online racing championships, where players can compete to be awarded special prizes. The game will also feature PlayStation VR support. GT Sport will include three game modes, Campaign, Sports Mode and Arcade Mode. Both offline and online racing will feature in the game. The game has been described as different from the prologue titles seen in the past in the series, and will feature more content. The game will not be a full featured release and is not considered part of the main numbered series. Number 2. Horizon Zero Dawn Horizon Zero Dawn is an upcoming action role playing video game in development by Guerrilla Games and published by Sony Computer Entertainment for the PlayStation 4. It will be the first intellectual property developed by Guerrilla Games since Killzone in 2004 and will be the studio's first attempt in developing a role playing game. Players take control of Aloy, a hunter and archer, as she progresses through a post-apocalyptic land which is ruled by mechanized creatures, such as robotic dinosaurs. The game is set in a future, thousand years from the present, in which human civilization has long abandoned Earth due to the world being dominated by robotic creatures. The component of these creatures, such as electricity and the metal they are composed of, are vital to Aloy's survival and she can loot these creatures' corpses to find these useful resources. The game's role-playing elements are set to be between that of Assassin's Creed and The Elder Scrolls V Skyrim. Players can use a variety of ways to kill enemies, such as setting traps like tripwires, shooting enemies with arrows, utilizing explosive and melee combat. Silent takedowns are also available. Players can also craft new items by collecting materials and machine parts found in the world. The game also features an open world, which can be explored by players when they are not completing missions. A dynamic day-night cycle and weather system will be featured, and Guerrilla Games have also stated that the game will feature no loading screens. And the number one, Uncharted 4. Uncharted 4 The Thief's End is an upcoming action-adventure third-person shooter platform video game developed by Naughty Dog and published by Sony Computer Entertainment. It is the sequel to Uncharted 3 Drake's Deception and is the fourth and final installment in the Uncharted series starring Nathan Drake, as well as the last in the series to be developed by Naughty Dog. Set three years after the events of Uncharted 3 Drake's Deception, Nathan Drake has presumably left the world of fortune hunting behind. However, it doesn't take long for fate to come calling when Drake's brother Sam reserves is seeking his help to save his own life and offering an adventure Drake can't resist. While the multiplayer was limited to a resolution of 900p, the campaign remains at a full 1080p. At PlayStation Experience 2015 it was revealed that the game will feature player controlled dialogue options, a first in the series. So these were the 9 most anticipated first party PS4 exclusives coming in 2016. If you enjoyed the video, show some love by hitting that like button and don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already. You can also check my previous videos by clicking to one of the thumbnails. As always, thank you very much for watching and see you next time.